What's good, y'all? Michael Peter Dave in our own video. Please go subscribe. Now, let's get to this Vikings. Listen, Kirk Cousins needs to go. Do I need to explain why? Do I need to explain it? Dude looked awful today. This is what the this is why I said I wasn't impressed with the Packers win. I'm not even impressed. I'll, I'll get to this in the later video, but I'm going to put a, a quick disclaimer. I am not impressed with their win against the Lions. They should have, if they really dominated the Lions, they should have never been down 14 to three. But this ain't about them. I'll get to that later in a, in a separate video. Kirk Cousins looks like he needs to be. He looks like he needs to be, needs to be benched. I don't know why they didn't kept Keenum. I don't know why they didn't keep Case Keenum. At least Case Keenum actually got you to the NFC Championship without Dalvin Cook, mind you. So, what's the difference? Ever since Kirk Cousins, he's only won one playoff game, and that was because of a Rudolph push-off. What's Kirk Cousins? Kirk Cousins doesn't. Kirk Cousins needs to go. You ship him. Hell, ship him to ship him to the football team. Actually, ship him to the Cleveland Browns. Ship hell, ship him to Atlanta. They're not keeping Matt Ryan. They're gonna find a way to get rid of Matt Ryan soon. But I'll, but I'll get to Matt Ryan in a separate video. That won't be today that or tomorrow. It will be most likely five days from now. That I'm going to talk shit on Matt Ryan. Understand something. You like that. Do you like that? So let me ask you a question, Vikings fans. Because I have respect for the Vikings fans. They are actually the fan base that I get along with. I actually feel bad for most of the Vikings fans, except for Sam Olsen, who apparently is a Vikings fan, from my point of view. What's your excuse about Kirk Cousins looking bad today? Why did he look awful today? He only got – his line did decent. They only give up three sacks. Do not blame the offensive line. They're, eventually, this Minnesota defense is not going to get care anymore. They're going to get torched by these teams because their offense can't do anything. Uh, you're you're winning at this point. You're winning three games at, this year. You might be lucky and beat the Detroit Lions that refuse to move on from Patricia. You might be bottom by the end of the season. You might be fourth by the time the season's over. You actually might not win a game because of how bad Kirk Cousins looks. Oh, I'm sorry. It, are we sure they're going to beat the Titans next week? Are we sure? Are we sure? Man, if I'm Delvin Cook, man, I'm demanding a trade. I'm demanding a trade. Can I go to Washington? Can I go to a winning team? Can I go to Baltimore? Man, if I'm Delvin Cook, I'm demanding a trade. If I'm Delvin Cook, that's what I'm going to do. I'm demanding a trade. You either trade Kirk Cousins or you trade me. Kirk should have Cook should have just sat out the entire season. Either Cousins leaves or I leave. It's plain and simple. If I'm Kirk, Cook, I'm demanding a trade. You're 0-2. You're 0-2. This season hasn't the season has rarely started and you're 0 and 2 and you're bottom front of the division behind Detroit. I don't want to hear your excuses. Don't give me these excuses about Kirk Cousins. He's not the guy anymore. Is he going to be he's not going to he's not going to be a second half. Hell, I am shitting on him more than I'm going to shit on Matt Ryan. In a five days from now. Kirk Cousins is the epitome of Matt Ryan. But Kirk Cousins is actually worse than Matt Ryan at this point. Matt Ryan only, at least Matt Ryan has went to a Super Bowl. And he's won every beat. What has Kirk Cousins been doing? Kirk Cousins has literally been the best quarterback. I don't know. 
Maybe, maybe, maybe it's because the full, the Redskins system looked better than the than the um, Vikings. This is why Stefan Diggs wanted to leave. This is why he was upset that Kirk Cousins was his quarterback. Now Stefan Diggs is two and zero. He's two and zero, and Kirk Cousins is zero and two. He's literally lost to Philip Rivers. Philip Rivers didn't even have to have a didn't even have to have a big game, and he still won. But anyway, if you're a Vikings fan, I feel your pain. I literally had to suffer seven years for Cutler. But if I'm the Vikings, I take the L. You ship Kirk Cousins. You ship Kirk Cousins. You ship him. Or else your defense or else you're gonna your defense is not gonna care anymore. How many times do you need to see Kirk Cousins fall on his face before you realize he's not the guy? How many times do you need to see that? Anyway, uh, that's that's all for today's video. I feel bad for the Vikings. Vikings fan base. They have to see it and watch this shit every day, every Sunday. But anyway, that's it. That's all. Subscribe and always bear down.